TFC fight number two, event one. Russia versus the Czech Republic, both very tough sounding countries. That's right. Ooh, there's the ladies again. They're the ladies with better outfits this time. A little seems. better, yeah. Less clothing. I like the there's... blonde one in the front. Yeah, me too. There's oh, the skirts are still here. Never yeah. mind. <laughs> the they're skirts, just, the leather. They're hiked up a little bit. A little more. bit. Yep. Oh, they're the judges. The judges. The Being angry held judges. Hostage. And, exactly. An angry Svetlana. Svetlana with the mic that's red. She's she's very aggressive looking, but very she's uh, she's kind of pretty. She is very you know? pretty. I agree. She's got the heels on. She could kiss you or kill you. Yeah, she could kiss you and kill you at the same very time. Very nice. Yeah, wow. Yeah, these judges, just like the last fight that we looked at, just not thrilled to be there. Not at all. And Sergey's got the little GoPro on him. Sergey, yeah, indeed. So this is the Russian team. Okay, Russian team looking about as expected. Yep. There's a few tough ones, you can tell. Yeah, this guy in the front has uh, like that fighter posture. Yeah, he you definitely can tell. Does. And, um... There they are. Different shorts, though. Yeah, brightly colored shorts. And Czech Republic's coming out now. Let's see what they're wearing. Yeah. See, I always think it's the bouncers. Yeah, guys. I always think it's the bouncers, but the bouncers so far have been the biggest. Yeah, these guys look marginally tougher than yeah. the other guys, right? I agree. Okay. The Czech guys all have the shaved heads. Yeah. Oh, yeah, those guys look a little scary. Exactly. Part of it is the Russian uniform with the, um, gr was it gray-brown shirt? It doesn't yeah, it's work. It's like an army green. Yeah, it's like an army green. Something. I don't know what it is. So they're shaking hands, and Sergey's going to break down the rules. There we go. No biting, no eye gouging, no hitting to Adam's apple. Yeah. Wow. Look at his facial expression. Yeah. That one Czech fighter hit his head. He's ready to get hit. Oh, he's so yeah. ready. All right, are they going to sprint gonna at each sprint other again? Each other? Let's see what happens. I think so. I go. see. They're charging up, priming yeah, yeah. up. Yep, this sprint. Another sprint, Ooh. another jump yeah, kick. Yeah, jumped. Ooh, there's a few clinches. A bunch of and clinches. Now you'll notice all of so. them are on the ground with the exception of one. Oh, the one, exactly. And now they're on the ground. Ooh, side control. Yeah, he's got a good position ooh, here. This, yeah, this guy knows what he's doing. Mm -hmm. He's got an overhook on the yeah, bottom. Overhook. And, ooh, this guy's fully mounted. Ooh, he's got a... But he should close his... He should, yeah, he's in half guard, but yeah, he's doing close. a good job controlling the posture mm -hmm. and staying safe. Exactly. That's important. And more blows getting rained down on him. Every fight's on the ground now. Yeah, all of them, whether it's in the mount or in the guard. Is that a guillotine attempt? That is a yes, but the guy's past the side control, so uh, he needs to let it go or he can, he's going to get Von Flu jokes. Oh, you makes gotta sense. got to let it go. Mm -hmm. This guy's trying to slam, it looks like, or headbutt? Yeah, still got the overhook. Mm -hmm. um, it actually looks like some of these guys have some legit ground training. Yeah, it looks Solid like. positions. Makes sense. I mean, Russia's got the Sambo going you on. Look at that. Like, three out of five of these guys have overhooks in the guard yeah. right now. Wow. This guy's Ooh. going with this uh, crafty mount escape. Exactly, he's trying to sweep. Which does work, by the way. And these guys, this guy on top here raining down elbows, doing the right thing as mm -hmm. well, keeping his weight very centered. Oh, makes sense. Ooh, it looks like that guy on the left's about done. Ooh, shirt pulling. Yeah. Shirt pulling, yeah, that's very interesting. Uh, blows to the back of the head yeah. appear to be legal as well. Exactly. 12 to 6 12 elbows. 12 to 6 elbows. Right to the back. This guy's getting out of there. Ooh, the Try shirt's getting too. ripped up. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, this guy's got a very high mount. Mm hmm. This guy's just done. Elbows, elbows, repeated are, forms and uh, elbows. Yeah, very ooh, nasty elbows. that elbow felt like it hurt to the rib. This, ooh, stop! Yeah, this Ouch. judge has got to stop it. What's this guy gonna do? This yeah. guy's going for that escape still, but that high mount's yeah, real tough to get anything. out of. Oh, it looks like he's done. Yeah. He's done. And now we've got multiple attacks. Yep, now it's we two know on how one. Goes. I like how he dove into that yeah. other guy to pull yeah. him off the other friend. I saw, because before that other guy was on top, and yeah. now he's done. Yeah, very interesting. 12 to 6 elbows, soccer kicks. These soccer kicks. Stomps, nasty. ouch. And it's hard to watch. Knees. Yeah, these are some good knees from the clinch yeah. guy, staying nice and safe, keeping his head covered. Exactly. Ooh, a choke attempt right there in the bottom. I think he missed yeah, it. Yeah, he missed it. Um, ooh, this guy's basically done. He's just turtled up, yeah, just waiting turned. to get hit in the, in the ribs. This guy's still kind of going. A legit knee, I yeah. suppose. Oh, he's gone. I think yeah. there's only one or two guys left on the Czech team. It looks like it, and he's just getting kicked in the head yeah. now. Falls right back. Ooh. Nice little roll. I like that, yeah. Ooh, this other guy's about done. Yeah, he's done. Yeah, when you got a guy dropping elbows on your back, um, I don't know what you're going to do about that. Exactly. Oh, yeah, he's like this guy. Like, this guy turtled right here. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, the team is obviously yeah. letting him up, you yeah, know? Yeah, exactly. Um, they could take advantage of that very easily, it exactly. appears. This guy's in the corner, still expected to fight five guys. Yep. Wow. Let's see how he handles this. Oh, yeah. there's still two of them. Okay. He's in the middle now. They dragged him to the ground. Yeah. This is the guy who was turtling. And this is interesting. This fight has been going on for three minutes, yeah, three which minutes. I think is a long time. It is for pretty like long. This. Yeah. 
These two just refuse to give up. These two in the Czech Republic. <laughs> yeah, um, I dig the turtle. I just don't know what the judges are looking for. Exactly. Ooh, that guy's almost gone. He almost fell backwards. Yeah, this guy's on the ropes. Uh, oh, they're repositioning him yep. is what they're doing. Oh, this guy goes for like, some sort of blast Ooh, double. he just ran him into the tires. Ooh, that Russian fighter's gone. Yeah, he took that guy out he with just a out. sort of a double leg. <laughs> and now he's kind of hiding. He's like, okay. It's still four and one, though. I don't yeah. know what else he can do. But he got the one. He That's got pretty the cool. one, yeah. 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 yeah, he's giving up now. Back on the ground, covering up. Wow. Well, we learned a lot about this one, yeah. just like we did with the last one, too. Um, I guess it's not impossible to just slam a guy into a bunch of tires and exactly. take him right out. Exactly. Some highlights here. Some highlights, some stomping, some knees, some 12 to 6 elbows, great roll right there. Yeah. So there was a lot of sambo and jiu-jitsu going on in this yeah. one. A lot of ground fighting. Yeah, but the problem that this, this type of fighting presents is you've got to go so quickly that you don't have time to set up a position or a submission attempt. Exactly. So the Russians have won this Excellent. match. Excellent. Excellent work. Which means um the Polish won the previous one, so the Russians are going to fight the Polish eventually. Oh, great. Which is old rivalries. And the, remember, the Polish guys were very yeah, large. they were very large. Good matchup. It was a good matchup, yeah. That's very interesting. Um, okay, so lessons learned. If there's tires nearby, throw a guy into Throw a them. guy's head into it, Tire, yes. Tires are heavy. I mean, that guy was dazed for sure. Yeah, he was. Yeah, so he was at the very least dazed. All of these fights ended up on the ground much quicker than the last uh, mm -hmm. the last fights did. It's under a minute, I would say. Under mm -hmm. 30 seconds almost. Mm -hmm. um, these guys were a lot more skilled on the ground, and you can see that the fight lasted much longer as a result of that. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of the time was spent staying safe, breaking down posture, controlling the guy's posture so you don't get punched in the head. Exactly. So, um, yeah, it just goes to show you once again that Sambo and Jiu-Jitsu goes a long way. It does. I wonder, um, I haven't seen any small joint manipulation or any of the sort of more dirty tactics. Yeah. Yeah, no, not yet. Nor have we seen any attempt at like a Kimura or an arm bar or anything like that. We've seen a couple people, at least in the last one, take the back and choke the neck. Mm -hmm. um, maybe mm -hmm. there was a guillotine attempt up in here. Uh, whether or not it was a good one, at least they're going for it. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah, I would be really interested to see if anybody pulls out something like an armbar or Kimura. Or even a footlock. You know, there's a lot of, like, toe holds, heel hooks, that kind of stuff in Sambo. I'd like to see if that actually goes down in this as well. Exactly. And um, we saw one or two guys in this fight try to muscle their way out. I saw a guy, maybe he was headbutting or he was trying to slam the guy who had him in guard. Right. I kind of expect to see more of that especially if it's a big guy and he's put into a guard by a small guy me too and you make a good point too that they don't note that headbutts are illegal so mm -hmm. i would imagine in a position like this when you've got a guy in the mount or whatever and the guy's controlling your posture just headbutt it yeah yeah exactly you know and that's something that i would expect a russian sambo team to know how to do. <laughs> exactly yeah so this is jerry and i'm here with trevor and that was fight number two of event number one that was fun thanks guys yeah thank you we'll see you next fight